I feel like I'm suffocating every time. It is five. Oh, it smells so good. It's 5.50 a.m. on a Thursday morning. And I'm very much up and just, you know, sporting my robe. Um, I'm gonna go get my hair together because I work at 9.30 today, so I want to start moving around from, like, now, because I think I'm going to leave at 6.15 to catch the first train at 7 or something. Oh. I've been up since 3 a.m. because I woke up and I just couldn't go back to sleep. And on top of that, I'm on my period, which is mad annoying. You know, life. <laughs> Just last week I was seeing it for like, I like working the early shift at work. I'm slowly reconsidering that to be honest. I mean, whatever shift I get, I have to take because it's not like you get to pick, choose, and refuse your shifts. I mean, sometimes you could be like, oh, hey, so can I get whatever, whenever? And it might be okay every once in a while, but you don't really get to just choose you want or whatever. Anyway, I'm going to go fix my hair. I'm going to put the bun closer to the top because when I'm sitting in the train, like, or just sitting, it's just too far back. Today, um, tonight, I think we're going to do the laundry. Dwayne said he's going to come get me at work so we can do the laundry. I don't know. I'm not really in the mood. At least right now. But that's hours away, so I guess I'll deal with that later. I'm going to fix my hair. right now I gotta go get a thing to tie it down so I've showered and I've gotten my hair done so now what I'm gonna do is see if I can make some breakfast to really quickly it's 619 right now pretty much 620 I'm gonna see if I can make some breakfast to um, take with me so I can eat it at work and I'm gonna make a cup of coffee right now to drink so I can be in high spirits and just a better mood to be at work and stuff like that so I'm gonna find like my undershirt and a thermal and stuff like that to put on. I have an egg going for the egg sandwich. I have, let me show y'all, the bird that I'm gonna put it on, the coffee is underway, egg, the water to make my coffee. And right now it is 6.31 and Mind you, I have to leave at like 6.50, 6.55. So I've 19 minutes, 20 minutes left. And I have everything else ready to go to. Um, this is the fruits from yesterday. I have an orange right here. And this is going to be my lunch. So I have a full um, day of meals. So that's breakfast, lunch, and dinner going on right there well not dinner um breakfast and lunch and like a light snack if i need it so i have all that going on but i'm about to um i'm about to go right now so i can make the coffee and drink it and, pre and put the sandwich together and then put my shirt on and stuff so guys i just left today it's supposed to be a rainy day right now it's not raining and i'm grateful um 
I finally took the freaking tempered glass off my phone and I'm 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 headed out. It looks kind of crazy right now, but I'm headed out. I put one on only to realize that you know, I put on the same thing that I literally dug off. So I left in a good time, but I wasn't crossing at the crosswalk. So it freaking took me forever to get across the street. And now I'm like a minute or two behind. The truth is in the mornings where I'm walking to the train station, I just give myself enough time to get there. I'm looking for this um lip gloss and I can't find it. Lips are dry as hell. I feel like it's kind of crazy. How many cigarettes people smoke daily? So I just passed the yard and the guy was smoking a cigarette, but then where he threw it, when I looked, there were more than a dozen, um, what you call it? Cigarette bits or the butts or whatever, right in the same area, which kind of shows you that that's where he smokes every day. And that's also where he throws it every day, which is ridiculous. Like, do you not add up like how much you smoke and how much you pay and see how much that's running you? And what about your health? I feel like I've never been one who's been interested in smoking. I'm not saying I've never tried it because I have. I've tried it once and it wasn't even cigarette. And this is not me even justifying smoking because I feel like it's bad either ways. Bomb. I'm never, I, I, I feel like I'd never try cigarettes because my grandma died from cigarettes from what my mom told me. So I just feel like you know, the family already had to go through this. I'm not trying to be that person who messes the whole thing up. So I'd never smoke cigarettes, but I just feel like it smells so bad too. Like I, I feel like I'm suffocating every time I smell the cigarettes and I can't be the only person.